it's Ocean Sims and welcome back to the channel guys. I am so excited because we are on a next episode of the Vandari Bunch and it feels like it has honestly been a while and I'm sorry. But look at our babies. If you caught my last video, which wasn't anything spectacular, but I did show me uh, kind of like decorating the twins uh, bedroom. We do have twin girls and I went for like a minimalistic kind of, you know, little Pinterest type of look here. Really nice for the country vibes. Um, I would like you guys to meet our twin baby girls. Let's head over to baby girl number one. This is Aksha and I love her. She's so gorgeous. Um, Aksha was like a name that I believe it said it meant blessing from God and I just feel like it's just really, really fitting and I love, I, I just love the name. Um, I want to stick with A names because the boys do have E names. So this cuteness right here is Anya, who is just so cute. Apparently it has different meanings depending on the culture, but it's supposed to mean like inexhaustible, like warm, courteous and yeah. And there's also different spellings but I just chose the spelling that I feel like the girls um, names really just represented so the reason why you only see their little feetsies here is because I do have an invisible crib mod um, where I can place these babies anywhere because uh, babies are objects and I have these custom cribs if you want to know more about the whole m crib situation definitely check out the video that I did of me furnishing their room so today we have oh the egg oh there's an egg ready to hatch yay this coop is currently at max capacity have roshni move this egg to another coop guess we need to get another coop <laughs> if you're watching this you're probably just a fan of the series in general so i can just actually be a little little honest with you guys right now and tell you that i really don't it's so snowy out here hold on i'm just not digging all this snow can they get in here there we go so i moved this egg and now we can go ahead and hatch some eggs okay cool as far as cottage living i think it's an amazing pack i think because i had early access to it i didn't exhaust necessarily the things that you can do let's just make a donation sure why not <laughs> but um i just had so much other things like going on that just that country lifestyle and everything was too pg for me not that i'm not having fun with cottage living is that what it's called? Cottage living or country living? It's not that I'm not having fun, but oh, look at this little stinker. I am literally not able to focus at all, man. Okay. But if I'm being 100% honest, this just doesn't fit my vibe at this current moment. Like the wholesomeness, the family stuff. I kind of have it mapped out. We will have about two more episodes of the Bandari Bunch until I revisit them again. I am hoping that there will be some type of family oriented pack or something relevant to them that I can also kind of tap into. But I think the country living stuff was very PG for me. Uh, and I just have certain things that I'm not, I'm interested in that I want to kind of tap into and this family will always be my safe place my safe haven but we're just uh eh, you know i want to kind of wrap it up and um possibly revisit the family when i can actually focus on them because they just deserve more than that i don't like rushing with them because sims die and i don't want them to be the same age forever so in order to prevent that and actually have them live a real life and story i need to put them at bay really quick so two more episodes of the madari bunch mom is making lunch varsha is looking good she actually gained a little weight which i love i love that how realistic this kind of looks because she looks a little wider i know after i had my three boys i got a little wider my hips kind of like sprung out so I'm really happy with the way she looks and she is too. She actually did some yoga this morning on her new yoga mat over here. Thanks to the spa day refresh. I really value the time we spend together. Yes. It really means a lot to me that you make time for me. Oh, what in the world? Ashan is just feeling so thankful and nice today. Maybe because it's New Year's Eve and he's like, new year, new me, mom. I decided to make a pantry, a little tiny pantry. This isn't a walk-in closet, but it just reminds me of kind of like the pantry that I have in my house because I downloaded a whole bunch of cool things and I will be doing a little video talking about all the objects that I need in game. Mom made us some fluffer nutter sandwiches, which she is going to tell Ashan to pack into this little like lunch thingy here because we are going to have a little bit of a picnic. Let's go ahead and just take this and place them in here so that we all can eat that. And then we'll have Ashan carry it. 
and it's cool because they don't have school today again the boys age up and everything today which is really cool i think we're just going to leave out with dad and let varsha have a little bit of alone time because that's it feels like she doesn't get that at all lately in fact i think she has to come up here and check on the baby soon yikes it is snowing <laughs> it is snowing this is not a good day to come here you see this beauty we are at the isle of Vope park which is crazy and i actually don't even think the boys got a a selfie with the snail yet let's take a selfie with the snail with sophie the snail i forgot who suggested to me but someone suggested that i have an episode where we just see things through the boys perspective um and this is the closest thing we're gonna get because i totally forgot so much had happened with the bandaris that i completely forgot to do that i see picnic tables so i'm gonna definitely come over here wait ashan's the one with the <laughs> with the uh, picnic basket i think i can place the picnic basket here and if not i actually let's just drag it because i don't want anything crazy to happen and then what i'll do is i will have everyone like sit together here as well but amir's gonna go take a picture with sophie the snail was this amir or ashan ashan ah, i keep getting it confused this is the story of having twins there we go we gotta get the antennas dude ashan is so cute big families are really really hard to play with like i'm not even gonna lie to you guys like i feel overwhelmed sometimes when i open up this save so that leads me to tell you that we are gonna age the boys up <laughs> I know you're like, whoa, did it really go there? It absolutely did. Let's go ahead and set up picnic. What does that mean? Oh, yeah, so it does work. Okay, cool. And then we can go ahead and pick up. Let's grab a serving together. Wait, did he just eat everything? Dad, Dad are you serious? Y'all, he ate all this. There was only one sandwich? What happened? Okay, well, so much for the picnic. I don't know what happened there, but it looks like Dad accidentally ate all the fluff or not sandwiches. Um... He's like, sorry, kids. I got hungry on the way here. Oh, come on, dad. Let's have a competition on who can build the better snow pile. So and Amir is going to build a snow pile with Imran, I think. And we're going to build one. Ashan's going to build one with Myra. We're going to have some sibling competition. The siblings against each other, except for they're taking the other sibling and going against each other. <laughs> that is cool. She's like, I've been dying to beat my brother all day. Oh, I can see these two be in trouble. She's like, let's go. Come on, Ashan. <laughs> I love this. Look at his face. I'm storytelling, but he's actually really taking this pretty serious. And I'm kind of like weak about it. I love it. Bro, come on. Don't talk to my dad. Just make the snow pile with me. He's supposed to come over here. She's like, see, that's why I don't play with my brother. Because <laughs> he's unreliable. Oh, now he's coming. Oh, sorry, Amir. Thought your dad had some more sandwiches. He doesn't. This is literally so cute. Like, who do you guys think is going to win? This is why I say the Mandaris just don't even have like a real goal or whatever. It's truly just gameplay. Oh my gosh. They made an old, old who? Who they make? Agnes Crumple Bottom. Oh, heck no. So you mean tell me you copied? You copied? You copied? All you did was give her pink mittens and an orange as a smile. It doesn't beat the spoon, bro. It doesn't beat the spoon. <laughs> so he made, we made Agnes and agatha hey. <laughs> let's have yash and roshni both just try and you know get close to the wildlife here you know i know i didn't capitalize much on the animals and all the goods here but it's okay she has to socialize with a fox or a rabbit or a bird like five times so we're gonna do that they aren't out yet guys they don't love me just yet let's give a gift um give some produce yes let's give you um a raspberry yes so we completed that milestone all right cool so we befriended them that was easy peasy and let's go here and check on yash you know you know the rabbits out here they love me <laughs> that's what he's saying oh you're so cute oh you're so cute we are back home and varsha is literally living her best life she's currently taking a bath because she probably finally just got the girls down or so she may think they're actually wide awake oh i just i just i want chunky baby so bad um looks like yash is out on the farm I don't know why I'm calling it a farm. It's not a farm, but he's out here doing his thing. You want to know something? I'm not really interested in like the animal clothes and stuff that came in this pack. Like I know if you were trying to see all of the things like the animal clothes and everything that came in here, uh, this probably wouldn't be the LP to watch because I did not capitalize on that at all because I just, I, I just, animals and clothing just bothers me. Oh, the birthday boys are all dressed for their party. They're feeling a little bit tired, which so I'm going to have to cheat that up a little bit because I want good energy. Oh no, baby sisters are having a... Bit. okay uh 
Look at them trying to calm the baby down. <laughs> Babies down. Because they're both like having a fit crying. Um, okay. And what is this? Ah, uh, no. Yeah, I should get in here and fix this sink. Now let's just replace it really quick. Leave it to Roshni to have to like take care of everything. <laughs> while our parents are down there. <laughs> it's crazy. Okay. Um, where is the birthday cake that Varsha made? Oh, she put it here. Ah, look at everyone. This is so cool. Look at everyone. And what is she wearing? What is she wearing? What? It makes me so mad when they do this. But look at this fly guy right here. This is Lyle Clifford. Dr. Clifford. You know. My cutie. I love him. He's so handsome. <laughs> He's so handsome. They're all here to watch our boys age up. That's amazing. Um... But if I could have everyone actually come over here, let's just do it here to be safe. Ah, uh, no, the counter's all dirty. Oh, well, things can't be perfect. <laughs> um, I'm sorry. It's just not like Varsha to have a cake on a dirty counter. So let's go ahead and taste the frosting. Oh, Amir's blowing out the candles first. And then baby bro, baby bro, they're twins. And Sean is going to uh, blow out his candles. And oh, come on, come on. He's not aging up. <laughs> he's not aging up oh my gosh i hate this it's new year's eve so i totally forgot that everyone is also like watching new year's eve tv on their birthday i feel so bad um but this looks so lit it looks so like full of people and it just looks so cool i wish the the girls the, our little twins were also just crawling around that would have been so adorable and cute oh man let me see if i can just age these boys up just so i can have them aging up. I'm just gonna go ahead and do it this way through this little Miss Sam age up um, anyone kind of mod that I have anyway. So I'm gonna do that. Thank you, Amir aged up. So I know off rip that Amir is going to have a knowledge aspiration because even though they both had the same whiz kid child aspirations, he's always been the the whiz kid. You know what I mean? Him. So I think I'm going to do nerd brain because I don't really use that one. It's when they want to be both book smart and handy. And I do want him to be kind of like a tinkerer. Is that a word? I don't know. But <laughs> honestly, let's just randomize. Genius, loner, romantic. I'm keeping it. Let's do it. <laughs> that is like some really cute traits he could have. Moving on to Ashan. He is so rambunctious. It's going to be cliche, but I think I really want him to just be like um, really focused on his body, bodybuilder status, really athletic. I really don't know what I want his other traits to be. I think creative is really cool because he did draw more than Amir. He does love the outdoors like Yash. I will say that he does love the outdoors. Um, morning jogs and everything. That's his, that's his, that's his vibe. We'll be, oh, look at our twins. <laughs> Dude, we have twins. Wow. Oh my gosh. They need a makeover like right now. So because Raul's here, I can have Roshni convey the mayor's feelings now and get rid of this errand because it's never ending. Every time I complete one thing, something else has to be done. So I'm going to just go ahead and get rid of that right away. This is what the mayor actually said. She wants you to live your life. We only got 175 simoleons for like a, a errand that took me like three days. <laughs> So Raul says, knowing I have the mayor's support to experience what lies beyond Hinford on Bagley makes my idle daydreams not seem quite so distant. I'm going to keep the photo you shared and perhaps one day I'll see it with my own eyes. But for now, well, I think I'm going to go tuck into another chocolate pie. Dude, I had to make him chocolate pie. I had to go to, I went to Foxbury and showed him like what real university looks like. I did so much for this friend. We're friends. We're pretty close. In fact, I think Roshni's going to be a little bold and just say like, uh... By the way, you look really cute today. Haha, <laughs> 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 you look really cute today, Raul. I don't know. I could totally see her and, and Raul being a thing, you know? And Dr. Clifford, you're kind of in between something. He's like, oh, thanks. <laughs> yeah, I really like that on you. I've never seen you outside of your grocery delivering clothes. Oh, no, no, don't. <laughs> this is why you don't flirt in front of Agnes. Oops, we forgot. That was embarrassing. <laughs> Crumple bottom. What's in that purse? Whatever it is, it hurt. She literally got scolded by Agnes, yo. Like, that's so funny. She would. All I did was try and flirt with him just a little bit because, oh my gosh. Yeah. Guess we won't do that again. Let's just go ahead and um, watch the countdown. Five minutes. Yay. <laughs> Happy New Year. Yay. Happy New Year. 
Oh, everyone's excited. Oh, that's so cute. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, everyone. Oh, but we're giving hugs to our brother. Oh, she gave a kiss. To the oh, I love them. Did you see that? Everyone's having some cake and some of this leftover quiche that I made. I think it was, a, no, frittata. <laughs> and yeah, we're just chilling right now. So I think I'm going to go ahead and give the boys a makeover and then we will end the episode right there. There's certain traps I can't escape You set them down and walked away So now I'm here alone Just waiting, hoping that you'll come and save me But I think I gotta fix this by myself I don't need a mix in someone else I can't even think under your spell Could be getting by with just your smell Now there's nothing left inside my So I am done with the makeover and now I can finally show you guys the new and improved uh, twins. So here is Amir. He is so stinking cute. He's cute. I actually just wanted to kind of keep his same like, well, not the same, but I wanted to keep his glasses. So he's, you know, he's just going to get progressively worse vision like me. And uh, he has a very like mute and mellow kind of color uh, choices when it comes to his attire. So like blacks and blues and grays and that's just kind of like how I wanted him to be and I really love oh man I just remembered I added body hair on him and not Ashan we had to add body hair on Ashan but I love his outfits and his signature is this watch here that he'll always wear and then we also just you know have a simple winter look um so he's look I love Amir very much but Ashan was super fun to dress because Ashan just has more of like a spunky personality anyway so with Ashan, I know I wanted one of them to have some facial hair and I chose Ashan just because, I don't know, I just, I just wanted him to. I compared it and I just really loved um, him having facial hair, getting facial hair before Amir. I left his outfits really simple and chill. He loves sneakers ever since he was a kid. You guys know that though. And his signature is like gray sweats. Like he doesn't really <laughs> dress as well as Amir. Like Amir actually dresses pretty well and has a nice fashion sense but Ashan just kind of like slaps whatever on <laughs> and like the same sweats that he sleeps in is the same ones that he'll leave the house with so uh yeah the most spruced up outfit he has is his party outfit and that is because it's a party outfit um and then everything else is just pretty chill like his winter outfit again he just has sweats and a big old jacket with the same sneakers and stuff like that so I really love that let's go in game and see how they look literally as soon as we go into game Roshni's like school is stupid I should be able to start working or living life can I never go to school again um don't grow up until you need to love because literally like life is this these are the best years of your life before you have to pay bills and all of the above let's go look at our twins look at Amir oh my goodness he's already what taking selfies or <laughs> responding to a tag because he's so cute where is Ashan and wow, Ashan is up here on his parents' computer. So next, I have to redo their room because this is totally outplayed. We have to change up some things. Definitely do. I might even change the layout so that there's fair space for the girls and stuff too because on the next episode, they will be aged up. I definitely don't want to keep them babies um, because babies are boring. <laughs> babies are so boring. All right, let's uh, go jog to clear 
Ashan's. I would have hung out with Amir, but Amir's taking a shower right now. He's having his uh, me time. He's like, forget the party. I am totally done with this. My social media is uh, running low. So I'll take Ashan to go out on a jog really quick. Two more episodes of the Madaris, and then I think I'm going to wrap them up because just in case EA decides to drop something super family related or whatever, I want this, this family to kind of be open and option like an open option for me especially because we do have so many kids in this in this family like you know like so many things happening so i'm going to wrap them up soon so that we can focus on a new lp that i want to work on i want to work on something new i'm kind of like um i'm open to suggestions but i i am I kind of know what I'm going to work on, but I do want to work on something new. That's why I had to clear the sketch. I had to clear the schedule. But I hope you guys enjoyed this this episode. If you did, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Just keep simming. Always, always, always stay wavy. And I will see you all in the next video. Alrighty. Peace out. certain traps I can't escape. You set them down and walked away. So now I'm here alone just waiting, hoping that you'll come and stay. I gotta fix this by myself I don't need a mix inside